Spring Arbor University has distinguished itself as a place where faith and learning meet. For over 135 years, and with an exemplary Christ-centered education, the university continues to see unprecedented growth. We're proud to say we are a top-tier liberal arts Christian university with over 4,000 students in an assortment of undergraduate and graduate programs, including education, business, communication, ministry, and art. With over 110 students, the art program is housed in the Ogle Art Center, along with the Ganton Art Gallery, a showcase for the art department. At 7,000 square feet, this is the largest single room gallery in southern Michigan and provides students an opportunity to display their art in a professional setting. Spring Arbor University students can pursue beginning and advanced level courses in drawing, painting, graphic design, photography, sculpture, art history, and art education. The program provides the foundation to pursue graduate work and the portfolio to secure a career in many art-related fields. These opportunities, coupled with rigorous standards, produce tangible results. Spring Arbor University is honored to be the home of a unique collection of southwestern Native American pottery. These rare examples give us a glimpse into the last known inhabitants of North America before the interaction of the Europeans. You can learn about pre-Columbian food, lifestyle, and trade through these ancient everyday objects. In this collection we can see the development of Southwest pottery. The earliest vessels showcased visible coils and a monochromatic surface. As the work develops we can begin to see black and white surface decoration. Later, this style would be replaced by polychrome decoration. The designs on the vessels are almost exclusively intricate variation in geometric design. With the most recent work at nearly 500 years old, and the oldest over a thousand, this well cared for collection is a testament to the role art plays throughout history. Here you see a modern-day recreation of this ancient art form as alumnus Aaron Cole shapes and models a vase from clay. Watch as he forms the base. From this foundation he begins to make the walls. As the coils build upon each other the vessel begins to take form. The coiled walls are then smoothed together and burnished with a stone to create a uniform surface. Finally, a design is painted on with black liquid clay. <laughs> 